In the last episode, I uncovered a secret walled village nestled in the mountains of Plover Cove and discovered natural beauties unlike anywhere else in the world. Join me in the final episode where I clamber over the mountaintops of Hong Kong, showing all of what the new territories have to offer. everyday hiking. My legs today are shaking and shivering like I'm standing in an ice bath. I gotta be honest, today getting up was pretty difficult. But we are up. Today we're going to a really cool trail on the rims of the mountains. Actually, I've been filming these mountains every day. They're beautiful. They overlook the village where I'm staying. Today we're going to be hiking on the peaks of them. Right now it's early morning, so the clouds are just rolling over the mountains. It looked gorgeous this morning, like a blanket of clouds. <gasps> I'm trying to pretend I'm not that <laughs> out of breath, but I am. Uh, we've been, I've been trying to go quite quick so we can get up there early and see the view from up there. But today is going to be a day full of amazing views. Hopefully, as long as the clouds do clear later on today. But as the sun rises, in general, that tends to be what happens right now we're just walking through the foresty area it's just nature waking up all around you it's a very cool experience to walk through so we're going to keep on going heading that way i hope i don't collapse of tiredness <laughs> let's go exciting but it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it. Oh, I'm feeling a bit tired. forest is going to be worth it, but uh, yeah, Woo. keep on pushing one foot in front of the other, we'll get where we need to go. one of the taller peaks in the mountain but currently we're inside a cloud so there's not much of a view 
It's quite cool though. The ambience is quite cool. It almost feels like it's nighttime. So not much of a view yet, but we're gonna keep on going. Peak number one hit, we're gonna be walking across all the peaks and I'm hoping that the clouds will clear up as the sun rises. It's still only 9 a.m. So probably gonna take a little bit of a break, eat some wasabi nuts and then head on and continue on the hike. But energy levels are a bit of a butt suck, but I think they'll get better as we keep going. I'm just gonna take a little bit of a break. Yeah and chill out here at the first peak. I'm not gonna lie, I did have to take a shit just over there. I went off the path, but still, oh, it's so gross. There's no public toilets, so I had no choice. Luckily, I brought hand wash and all that, but I did have to wipe my ass with leaves, so that was pretty traumatic. I'm hoping wasabi nuts will remove that memory from my mind. And yeah, I did it off the trail, so hopefully no one will find it, but I guess it's like a bit of me is here on the peak of this mountain. Some would say that's quite cool. As you can see, the clouds are beginning to clear and in front of us, we have an unbelievable view, unbelievable view of Hong Kong right now. And I'm just excited to continue walking. This entire trail is just over the ridges of these mountain tops. So it's a tough hike, but now with this view sort of joining us on this hike, I think it's gonna become a lot more satisfying and just a better experience. So <gasps> over there, you can actually see a Kunyum statue. And yeah, it's just amazing to see the mountain roll down to the little coastal side villages. Hopefully as the sun continues to rise, we will continue to get these amazing views. But so far, boom, Hong Kong looking gorgeous. Let's continue hiking and see what other spectacular views we can see. Just getting better and better. The sun is rising. Oh my goodness! Hong Kong looks gorgeous. We made it to the top of Shun Young Splun. I can't remember the full name, but it's one of the tallest peaks so far. I think it's gonna have the best view.
guys, this trail is unbelievably beautiful and I am unbelievably sweaty. <laughs> the sun is out, there's no clouds, I forgot sunscreen and I am indeed sweating quite a bit but super worth it to hike in this beautiful, beautiful environment. But I'm gonna keep going before I suffer heat stroke. highest peak in the hike from here on it's downhill from here but in a good way not in that negative expression literally is downhill and that'll be good for my legs I think so we're well over halfway the views from each of these peaks are insane I mean just check out the view from this one it is gorgeous but gonna take a minute take in suck in the atmosphere and then continue on but oh my goodness feel very fortunate to be able to see this view. On this side of Hong Kong, I had no idea it was so vast and just spectacular. <laughs> 